We go over to St. James now, where two houses said to be owned by the leader of the Pathways International Ministries, Dr. Kevin Smith, were searched by police. Kirk Wright is in St. James and now reports. This is the moment a small team of police personnel arrived at Dr. Kevin Smith's house in Coral Gardens in St. James. It was just after midday, and unlike yesterday when they came and could not access the property, firefighters came along. The firefighters cut the padlock to the main gate, paving the way for the lawmen to carry out their search. So immediately after the search team arrived here at the pastor's house, the road that the house is located on was cordoned off. So then we had no choice but to take our eyes to the skies. We understand that the bishop was present during the search of his house, but carefully hidden from our cameras. We did manage to get a glimpse of the pastor after he was taken to his house in Ironshore. From above, we observed not much movement on the premises at Coral Gardens, but we were reliably informed that the police conducted a detailed search of the house, looking for anything electronic, including clues that would help them determine how the pastor acquired his wealth. We understand that a submission was made to the Financial Investigation Division of the police force to proceed with that aspect of the investigation. So when the police team came, one of their private cars backed up in the driveway. So from our vantage point, we weren't able to see if any electronic uh, items or files were removed from the house. But after the search was completed, we were reliably informed that they got information that's now critical to moving their investigations forward. After some four hours, the team left here and went to Ironshore uh, to another house said to be owned by the pastor and did a uh, search there. We're not sure if anything was picked up there. Kirk right here in Montego Bay for TVJ News.